I have my material. I wrap it around two fingers like this. This sensitization program is simply on turning waste to wealth. One of the major concerns for the Nigerian Conservation Foundation. It is the turn of Metropolitan School and its community members to get knowledge about the benefits in wastes. For a community training for teachers and community members, um, waste to wealth training on environmental sustainability as part of the Rwanda Foundation Clean Our World project. The main aim of this um, training is attitudinal change towards um, waste management. We want them to know that there is, the waste is not wasted until it is totally wasted. So we believe that um, with the way um, this empowerment program is going, we are empowering the community members and um, it will also come as a source of livelihood for them if they begin to um, take this if they, if they, if they um, embrace it and start doing it and then probably um, training other people. Beneficiaries of the waste management training commend the move, expressing the impact so far. By gathering the lions in the school compounds, it will make the school compounds to be neat. There will be no littering of a lion around the school. And also, since then that you can last, we have started teaching the children how to make use of nylon to produce the yarn to knit. So the children have started picking up. So if they were able to pick it up, that one also will make them to be useful even in their compounds. We were trained how to use plastic waste to, uh, to make stood. We were trained how to use plastic, um, these uh, bottle break, uh, broken bottles to make a design, how to use plastic waste to make a flower uh, decoration in your house, which all the parents uh, at least have been doing and snapping and sending the pictures to us uh, on the platform. With this sensitization, perhaps this is the beginning of the end to the menace of plastic and other physical waste on land and in seas.